Okay, in this video, I wanna show you how to upload um, files. Uh, so sp specifically two things. We're gonna upload a flyer, which on this event search page will show here. And then also we'll show you how to change this logo. Uh, so you'll notice that right now, just uh, to kind of set up this video, this logo um, that I'm working with in this tournament is the, T the TW logo. It's the default. Uh, if you haven't uploaded your own event logo, that's what will show unless you have selected a particular governing body that has uh, logos associated. But generally, you're probably going to see this TW logo, but you can change that. So let's go into the tournament. I'm already logged in. And let's start with the flyer. So I want to upload a flyer to my event. So I'm just going to go to the Setup menu and then click Settings. And you'll notice that um, here's the spot where you put the logo. It's in this, um, this tournament info. And then the flyer gets uploaded right here. So if you had a link that this flyer was already online, you could actually just paste that link and it would, it would work. But if you don't have a link or you don't have that flyer that's online, you just click upload and then you're going to be able to search your computer. So I go choose file and then I'm just going to go to find, ooh, I think I already had it. I'm just going to find um, some, any document. Um, so actually, I'm just I'm just going to use this uh, image, which is just fine. But normally, you'd have a document there. Click open. And when I click continue, I'll hit save tournament info right here. And it's going to save everything. And then now, when I go back and somebody goes to search for my event, I'll reload this page. You're going to notice that now this is here. It says event flyer. I can just click it. It's going to open it. Um, that's not a very good flyer. But you would put your information for your event. Really, really useful, um, allows your um, viewers and customers and people coming to your event uh, to see that information very easily when they come here. Um, and then um, the other thing we'll cover is how to change this uh, logo. So it's back on the settings page as well. And it's the same exact um, process right here. I just go to event logo, click upload, and I'll actually just go and choose that same file, but you could put whatever you want. I'll use this star. I continue. It's going to upload that for you. Shouldn't take that long. My uh, uh, This runs slowly when I'm recording here. I hit save. And then now when I go back and reload this page again, when people come, you'll see that this uh, image also uploads. There. So there's that star. There's one other... Uh, thing that you can do um, within your tournament if you wanted to get uh, links and upload some files. There's some other applications for this if you're doing images on brackets and, and some certain other areas. Uh, but within the setup menu again, there's this file uploads. You can click there and then you'll notice that um, here's that star logo that I already uploaded using that other process. But if I just wanted to get links and put documents, images online to use in other places, I can do the same thing from this page. I would just click upload file. I'll choose a file. And let's say I want this image. Click continue again, kind of the same process. But now you'll notice that here's this image. It's online. If I click it, I can see what it looks like. And then all I would need to do is copy this. I could copy that and I could paste it into other areas. Again, the most common one that you may use this for is adding images to your brackets, but uploading files, getting flyers, changing your event logo, really easy to do, and hopefully this video helped you get there.